Metropolitan has two small chapels in the south corners of its sanctuary. The southeast chapel is the Eccles Baptismal Chapel. Dr. Eccles was a member of the first building committee of this church and the donor of the marble floor and font for the chapel. The Southwest Chapel is in memory of Mrs. Eccles. The two windows in the baptismal chapel are the works of Hobbes and are the first installations by Hobbes of a known date. Jesus with his mother and Christ Jesus our Savior were installed in 1938 in memory of Dr. Eccles' donations from his wife, Janet. The South Lancet presents Mary in blue, a long-standing tradition of her portrayal, and an adolescent Jesus in a simple villager's robe with a green sash. The barefoot Jesus has a halo. The North Lancet depicts a mature Jesus, filling the frame, robed in red, adorned with a halo. Jesus is blessing us, and his gentle gaze is on us, the viewers. On the opposite side of the sanctuary, in the Southwest Chapel, are windows installed in 1939 by an unknown maker, but probably Hobbes. The Nativity and the Light of the World are placed in memory of Mr. Charles Norman Spencer by his wife, Mamie. In the Nativity scene, the South Lancet, Mary is surrounded by white lilies, emphasizing her purity proclaimed in her blue robe. Joseph prays in wonderment over the baby Jesus, and in the detail, as the carol sings, the ox and ass are looking up from their feeding. The Northern Lancet shows two magnificent angels praying to the infant Jesus in the neighboring window. A gentle sheep takes in the scene of the one who would become the Lamb of God. As with all of Hobbes' work, there is great detail and very gentle colors. Owing to some building renovations, the windows in the baptismal chapel are not lit by sunlight, but can radiate their message when interior lights from behind that wall are turned on. Jesus is the light of the world.